Joseph, you and I met a couple years ago. You actually was raised in Shelby County, right? Right. We hunted a piece of property out there and Dave was with us that day. And about three or four weeks ago, you called me and said, hey, Dave's actually getting ready to get deployed. We'd like to get him a rabbit hunt in beforehand. Do you have any interest in rabbit hunting? Well, I always have interest in rabbit hunting, so <laughs> you were like, hey, let's try out at my place at Cox's Creek. So that's where we're at today in Nelson County. Now, this is the area you rabbit hunt a couple times a year, right? Yeah, about once a year is all I really rabbit hunt. But yeah, Dave's about to get deployed, so I wanted to get it in uh, and before he leaves, and this will probably be my only hunt of the year. You enjoy hunting, but this is pretty much what you do, rabbit hunting, right? I always make time for rabbit hunting once or twice a year, and it's about as far as my hunting goes. You and I text and email back and forth, you know, hey, getting ready for rabbit season, and uh, we've probably communicated eight, ten times since last year's rabbit hunt, and today was the day to finally put it together. So getting dogs on the ground, and hopefully we get some bunnies. Sounds good to me. Hunt here, hunt here, hunt here, hunt in here. Come on, hunt them up. That bark almost sounded like I stepped on a thorn bark and not a rabbit bark. So Dave, is this your first rabbit hunt of the year? Yeah, first hunt of the year. Got a newborn at home, so I didn't get to do as much of any kind of hunting as normal this year. Yeah, that definitely takes a little time. We've actually hunted with you guys in the past, and you and I fun hunted this place last year. Yeah, I think it might have been the last day of rabbit season. I think we got five or six. Yeah, like we had a couple pretty good runs, so I'm excited to get back out here and see this property again, and hopefully the dogs jump in some rabbits. I tell you what, this little sleeve right here, I know sometimes holds some bunnies. I say we move up through here and see if we can't get something kicked up. What do you think? Sounds great. Hunt in here, hunt in here. Hunt in here. Josie, get in there. Get in there, hunt them up. Get in there. Get him out. I'll tell you what, we just hit some of the best areas this farm. We had to deal with some fences and it was mainly thin fence rows. Now it gets really thick where literally every step could hold a rabbit. That's a rabbit. We got a run going on. The dogs kind of came back to us and uh, seems like maybe the rabbits hung up right up here in this big pile. They went way out, 150, 160 yards and turned, and I saw something come through right here and I thought it's gonna run right to me. Well, the dog somehow overran it just a little bit and got on this side of the rabbit. It jumped and they took off, so now we're running it for loop number two. <laughs> Coming at you, Dave. Coming at you. Ah. <laughs> he flipped him. <laughs> Good shot. Yeah, it stopped right in front of me, but my gun didn't cycle. I had to kick the shell out. Here, 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 dead, 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 dead. She looked at it and don't want to believe that's the right one. They want to think there's another one. I'll tell you one thing, it ran right by Joseph. I saw you kind of spin and angle in front of me. I thought that rabbit's running right to me. About that time you rolled it. Yeah. It was a good shot. All right, you want this in your sure. back here? Yeah. All right. There you go. Got it! Hell yeah! We worked through this real fast because we literally had a rabbit on a chase and went in a big circle. Well, everything inside that middle, we didn't really hunt. Dogs went back and jumped another one up. I believe Joseph may have got it. That's pretty exciting, really, because y'all were working on this rabbit over here, and Dave ended up getting him. Finally got that rabbit down. Well, by that time, you guys had jumped one up. There could be another rabbit or two in oh, here because it's just a big circle. We left this acre or two right here in the middle, and you came back and cleaned it up. Well, I'm glad we got two. I was kind of worried there for a minute. <laughs> If you want to hunt that fence line up there or hunt here, going up that way, make a right turn, come back, I don't know. Did they ever get in a sinkhole right there? No. Well, I say we get them in there for a second. Get in there, hunt them out. Get them going, hunt them up. Hunt them up, hunt them up. Oh, quail. You sure that's a quail? Oh, it's a woodcock. I've never seen one. Had a big old long beak. Snipe got a big long beak like that, don't they? Yeah, there it goes. Well, this is the far back side of the property. We've crossed two creeks to get here. I can count on probably two hands the amount of times I've even been back here, but we'll rabbit hunt and see what happens. It might be great, it might not, but we're about to find out.
That is a beautiful sound, isn't it? You think they lost it, and all of a sudden you hear one bark, and then all four open up in a dead straight line, barking and running? Yeah. That's a good shot. I thought I made a mistake there for a minute, because I thought he was going to go a different direction. I wouldn't be able to see him. And I thought maybe I should have unloaded all three rounds right there. <laughs> but we got him. There he goes. Coming your way. You see it? Yeah. There you go. Nice. Well, I can't tell you guys how much I appreciate it. Thanks again. Hey, thank you for your service. Thanks. Get in touch with us next year when you get back in town, and we'll have to do it again. Sounds good to me.